All right, guys, it is time. Today we are here. Let me go ahead and check the audio real quick. One second. Hope you guys are all doing well. We're here with a, a Blood Bowl stream. It's going to be a good time. I think my audio is a little bit loud, so let me turn that down. Recording, microphone. So, yeah, we're going to be here with a Blood Bowl stream today. It's going to be week three of our Wild Hog season. And it's going to be myself facing off against the Skaven. And today we have a celebrity co-caster. So I'm going to be here with the Gobble King. So let me go ahead and play with my green screen real quick before we get rolling. I know there's like green madness in the background. So give me one second, guys. Hope you're all doing well. And yes, I did get a haircut, if anyone's asking. No longer do I have the, the glorious Jesus locks of old. So it's, it feels a little weird without him, but you know, such is life. Okay. I'm like sparkling. I'm like one of the Twilight vampires. <laughs> Where's the hair? <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry, okay? All right, so we're gonna jump over guys. No, no, I've it's, it's completely cut like I've I've this is how my hair was my entire life. So um, I hate this webcam so much. <laughs> I hate it. <laughs> this is trolling me. All right, so we're gonna jump over to the Gobble King and it's showtime guys. We're doing it. So all right, guys. I'm here with uh, Gobble King, so we're gonna we're gonna do a little co-commentary today. It's time. You ready? Yeah, I'm ready. Hopefully, uh, it's not, it's not like we casted my game yesterday, and like you were super quiet. No, I see. I see the audio feeds and everything, and it's looking looking pretty golden. Oh so, yeah, dude, it's so bad. <laughs> I'm just like just whispering like, in the shadows. I was like, yeah, man. What do you think about that? And you'd be like, yeah, guys. What do you, what do you think about that? <laughs> just all feebly <laughs> whispering in the shot in the darkness. <laughs> It just makes it look like I was a crazy person, but like the the demons whispering in my ear were like, like they might be real. <laughs> exactly. Oh man. So yeah, tell us a little bit of the matchup. So we got Nurgle. That's my team. This is week three. So currently I'm one and one. I won my first game against the Empire. Then I lost to the Lizard Men in week two. And uh, I think everyone. I don't think anybody's undefeated. I think everybody is like two zero and one or two and one right now. So. Uh, all right, let's let's uh, let's pull it up here. Yeah, check it I, out. I can pull up the league stats while uh, we wait for your game to fire up. Let's see the teams. We got uh, the all right leaderboard. Here we go. Oh, he got a wizard. Oh yeah. <laughs> so I'm facing off, Harry Potter. I'm facing off against the Skaven guys, and since his team's a little bit beat up, the way the game balances itself is it gives him like extra money to buy like uh, star players or things like that. So he actually bought a wizard, which can like literally lightning blast me. It's pretty ridiculous. Well, he has two options with the uh, the wizard. You can either do like a single point target and yeah. just like it's like a guarantee sniper shot. So like, so you paid off some wizard in the crowd, and he's just gonna lightning bolt you, just yeah. like that meme, <laughs> like yeah. he's larping. Yeah. Uh, or he can do a fireball, which is an area effect. It works just like the bomb. So everybody in the area effect is like in a four plus to get. Oh, hit. dude, I do, uh, it's so it's a fifty fifty, huh? Yeah. There's the uh, there's I mean, the filthy rats. Game's up, All by right. the way. If you wanna, if you're ready to join in Cabal. All right. There's the Skaven thrower. You guys see him starts. with the, like the the, <laughs> the rocket launcher arm. Oh, dude, I love him. I think Skaven. I think Skaven are the best team. You think that like if you like played by some of the best players in the world, they would just be the most competitive? Uh, I think I think so. But like, Chaos Dwarves, I think have won the most uh, grand tournaments. Yeah. Yeah. But, like, I've never seen Skaven not do well. Well, what about Wood Elves? Don't they kind of have, like, similar speed and characteristics, but maybe even a little well, bit they're better? They're faster. They're yeah. a fast team, but they don't really have anyone that kind of starts off. They're not as bashy. Yeah. And I think that's why... Um, I'm taking the ball. I don't want his gutter runners getting this. I need to beat him up before he gets possession, you know? So let's see what's going on. So he gets to set up... Uh, he sets up first. So whoever's receiving the ball gets the benefit of setting up second. So I get to kind of counteract his, uh, his place here, so... <laughs> yeah, I think this is. I actually think it's the difference between like actual uh, football and like bubbles. I think it's better to get the ball first because that way you can start inflicting casualties. Sooner. Exactly, especially against a squishy team like Skaven, who are all. I think they don't have anything that's. Do they have rat ogres in this? I don't think they do. Do no, they? they do. They have rat ogres. They do. Okay. I have a glitch. I got. A, I got a screen photo where like the head of my rat ogre like got popped off and got put onto his crotch. It's like this little bitty rat head. <laughs> <Just> <laughs> it's like, <laughs> oh, just a rat dong. Oh, that's so cool. This little rat dong is like going, hee hee hee. That's so gross. It's like a helpit abomination almost. But it, yes, oh, it, yeah, dude. He's got but a I couple feel, injuries. Uh, he's got this uh, uh, Licto of Mordheim. He has a, a niggling injury. And then I think his thrower does too. So if I can get in there and like blitz him, oh man. 
I think he has two guys with injuries. The, the difference between the Wood Elves and the Skaven is the Wood Elves are very expensive, where the Skaven you can get like free dudes. I mean, they're, they're, they're so much cheaper that like an injury to a Wood Elf like takes them, can take him out of the league, whereas an injury to a Skaven team, like whatever, it's just another rat. <laughs> it's just, just another, like it's another, just filthy another rat. One. And it's just like the lore. Like in the in the tabletop, they had a game called or they had a rule called Life is Cheap. Yeah. <laughs> so like you can put your heroes in the back of the unit. It's the same way. They actually have that in um and what's it called? Uh, let me get these goats back here. And when you're playing the trash campaign, or I think a couple of the other Skaven Lords, it's like one of the passives you can actually get is the life is cheap thing. Oh, yeah. And it's like they also had a, a rule where you could shoot in the combat on the tabletop because normally you couldn't. But like with the Skaven, because they had the rattling guns aren't in the Total War or Warhammer yet, but they're just like little mini guns. <laughs> and so like you just throw your slaves in the combat and you just open fire with all your machine guns on the hill. Let's see. Oh, Anna. Hey, Anna. <laughs> What's up, darling? Yeah, she Ooh. turns hair. Got the wife intervention. Yeah, she she was kind of like like whispering in my ear about getting haircuts for like a month. <laughs> oh, look at you! Give us a little bit of a profile look there. Kind of look off to the side and see what's going on. Yeah, yeah, I got the full. Uh, I got the full. Like it's 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 pretty high and tight. Yeah, you're not the Patrick Swayze anymore, though. No, I like no. you better when you're I Patrick Swayze. I lost my charm. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, that's a good kick. It's deep down there. Yeah, that's like that's pretty much on point. So we're gonna we're gonna run down here and get ready to go. Uh, hopefully my stupid goat can get it. Okay, so this guy yeah, I, I think I think Skaven are probably a little bit better than Wood Elves. Like Skaven are a little more forgiving. Uh, as for like beginner teams, Orcs and Dwarves probably have to be the best. Yeah, beginner. Dwarves are so easy. Like man, they start with so many good abilities. I'm not looking forward to that game. That game's gonna be boring. It's just gonna be me getting my face punched in. So it begins. Here comes the pound town. Oh yeah, I can't. Dude, that's gonna be. Oh yes, injury. Give it to me. <laughs> oh, he's just stunned. Okay. Oh. Okay, let's start. Oh, this guy's the injury thing. Oh man, this could be really bad. Okay, we're just put him. The food truck. <laughs> we're just gonna put him by the tickler. Just sacrifice to the gods. Yeah, the tickler. I mean, you may not be able to get to it, but like, the tickler needs to slowly waddle his way towards like the gutter runners. They're only string two. They'll never get away from that tentacle. <laughs> yeah. I want to get. I want to try and get one of these little bastards, but they're slippery. All yeah. Right. For those who don't know, like. Uh, there's a mutation that Chaos can get, and Skaven can get it as well. Uh, it's called Tentacle. So what you do is you have to roll two dice, and you have to get a, a five or less. And you can subtract the roll from your strength versus their strength. So basically his gutter runner to get away would have to roll, I think, an eight to get yeah. away from the Tickler. <laughs> the Tickler. <laughs> <laughs> so, so ridiculous. Yeah, guys, this is Blood Bowl 2. So this is basically like rugby, football, turn-based uh, Warhammer. So it takes place in the Warhammer universe. So hopefully you guys enjoy the, the mix-up of content here. So we're going to try and take out this this uh, gutter runner here. You know what? Ooh, I kind of want to take I, that both down. I mean, you do have armor 9. I could really. And mess. your disturbing presence always works. So Well, it doesn't matter. He's not going to throw the ball. Yeah. You know what? I think I want to pick up the ball, so I'm just going to push him for now. Oh, shit. I did not mean to say. Oh, well, it's okay. So uh, now... The 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 guy who's playing is Valnir nineteen. Uh, he does. I don't. To my knowledge, he doesn't have a YouTube channel. He's just no. one of the guys that's in the. I don't think he does. One of our buddies that plays. Okay, so let's go ahead and uh, probably want oh to. I'd like to get in the backfield and start working on that guy, but I think I just got to play it safer here. Yeah. He, well, you have to get the ball at some point, but you are a basher than he is. So you yeah, can, you can see a couple scaven going down already, which is nice. It's, it's not like my team. Like my team, I want a no touchy zone. Like you want to stay on top of them as much as you can. <laughs> we're we're on the hunt here. Now we're gonna try. So we got Gimp Mask. He's the he's my pesticide with block. So hopefully he can grab it. If he doesn't, it's fine. It's so far. Uh, he's the one that leveled up. He's gonna be a runner. He's got block too, which is gonna be pretty scary. And that's it for turn one, guys. So now I'll take some comments here. Father Nurgle's pleased. Yes, he is. And we are gonna let the boy watch Gojira. Yes. You know what I miss is the Beast of Nurgle. Like, this is an old, old rule, like second edition and stuff. It used to have, like, a slime trail that would leave behind it. He was way more disgusting from what I oh, saw. Oh, yeah, he would have this slime trail. So if your guys got, like, stuck in the slime trail, they couldn't move and stuff and, like, suffer penalties. I wish he had on Blood, Blood Bowl. Like, everywhere he moves, just, like, these little piles of <laughs> just sludge. <fell. laughs> it's just fully haggard and disgusting. I hope he tries to get away from the tickler and the tentacles just grab his ankles. How's I'm it going, sure Gary? What he's doing. <laughs> I, I am a little bit behind. Oh, yeah, I you're think, probably like three or four seconds behind, I think. 
Yeah, I think what I would do is like get, save the gutter runners first. Like, that's your team. Yeah, if I can kill the gutter runners, like that's why I, I went really hard for the uh, for the guy in the back there. But he's, it's it's pretty juicy to get those guys down. Um, and they have agility four and dodge, so they 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 would have to fa- they have to make two ones not to get there. Yeah, little bastards. But uh, yeah, John, there is a corn team. Uh, there wasn't Blood Bowl one. It never got added to two though. What do they have? They have a bloodthirster. I don't know. They call him something else though. I don't think he's actually called bloodthirster oh, for their big it. guy. Uh, they have a blood letters, and then they have like chaos warriors and mar- like marauders. Marauders. Hmm. Yeah, I would. I would have to pull up a blood bowl one to see. They were not a. We will we, we'll say this: they were not a ball handling team. <laughs> Just a bash team. <laughs> yeah, you didn't. You didn't play them to like throw the ball. That must have been pretty fun. Yeah, I'm. I'm. I, hope, I don't know if they'll add more more stuff to this. I think that'd be pretty cool. Oh, dude, there's all sorts of fan stuff. It, there's already a pretty deep. Are there roster. mods for this? They have like uh, modded teams. On, no, Blood Bowl One had more stuff, but it doesn't run as smooth. Yeah, got it. But you know, you still have like you got Lizardman, Amazon, Dark Elves, Camry, uh, Necromantic, Vampires. Uh, there's another undead team. I can't think of a name right now. You know, we're already up to eight. Halflings, Goblins, Orcs, and Goblins are just Orc team. Uh, under de- underworld denizens, scave- they're yeah, Skaven like and goblins, teams. right? Like a mixture of What's the two. Oh, uh, underworld denizens! Oh, yeah, I played once and <laughs> I got beaten so bad by you. <laughs> uh, yeah, we were just messing around. So they, they, they um, they're a, they're a, a Skaven and goblin team. What are their and big Skaven. guys? Do they have big guys? Like, don't they have trolls? Yeah, yeah they have a troll. Uh, their their rule is anyone can get mutations, so they can get like filthy presence or claws. So you have goblins with like two heads and three arms. <laughs> Did you see that? How behind are you? Uh, he, you know, he just got knocked over. Okay, so we're pretty darn close. Someone says I look 15 years younger. Well, you can thank Lady Turn for that. It was her doing. What well, does that make you like 12? Like... <laughs> yeah, it makes me like a wee lad. <laughs> Back when you were mean mugging. Yeah. Mom, come mom. on. Mom, come on, mom. All right, so we're gonna we're gonna run up the field a little bit here. Start our inexorable advance of Nurgle. It's time. What's your like, what's your like, opinion of the Nurgle team? Like, do you think like from the leagues you've watched and things like that, do you think they're a pretty solid team? Or, uh, I think they do well versus Agi teams. Like, I think like, overall, like regular Chaos is probably a more competitive team. Yeah, because yeah. the Nurgle can only get. Was it, no, I think it's the same. Yes, yeah, it's, it's the same. But like the the Chaos team is just a little more bashy. Like, they're a little bit cheaper, so you get more guys. The Nurgle team, they have a. They have a what is it? Disturbing presence. And so anytime someone tries to throw, catch, or intercept the ball, you get minus one. Yeah. Uh, if you're within, I think three hexes of them. Yeah, they're pretty beasty. Like they. To me, that's too slow. Yeah. Oh. But, uh, oh man. I don't, how do you feel about? I like the, the Nurgle team. I feel like I'm, they're pretty similar to like standard chaos, but they do start with that disturbing presence, which is and which gets really can be nice even against teams like this that I'm fighting now. Um, Boy, yeah, he he might actually throw the ball though. Yeah, if I can get that. Uh, he's got he's got that dude with the rocket arm right there, just like lined up. <laughs> I'm gonna dude. I'm gonna butter his bread. I'm trying to get to him. Oh, damn it! So tough. I did I take know, down that the gutter runner. I knocked him down at least. Or, oh, that was just a lineman. Oh, that's not as good. Can we can we get the Blitzeru going here? Can you one two? Three, yeah, I have, no, I, I got to just bash this guy. I think you got to do some razzle dazzle to get just there, a, man. A little little shake and bake. Oh yeah. And then we can just stay here actually, and then we can blitz the gutter runner. I'm surprised not. I've gotten a lot of downs, but he's been pretty durable so far. I don't know. Some, I feel like this is one of those games where you just. Like, I don't know. Oh, th- we're definitely taking this one. Got gotcha. you. Yes, you filthy rat. <laughs> Down you go. He's just, he's just hanging out next to your little beast Nurgle there. He is. Well, he can't get away. The tentacle roll is going to be... He's going to have to, like... He'd have to get two more rats there to even try and overpower the beast. So the beast oh, of Nurgle has this ability, guys, called the tentacles. And whenever someone tries to dodge out of his tackle box, there's basically a chance he can grab their leg and <laughs> hold them there. <laughs> just all disgusting with his like herpy tongue and just uh it's so gross <laughs> <laughs> just trolling hey guys i want to play <laughs> yeah yeah it's they have beasts of nurgle on tabletop did you ever play like against nurgle armies and in, in your uh warhammer fantasy or 40k days well they didn't have a 
They didn't really have a, like official Nurgle stuff to it, kind of later. So it, it used to be like Chaos was just Chaos on. Yeah, yeah. yeah they, they would come in. They would have like one unit. Yeah, but like, here's the thing about Nurgle though. Like, every Chaos God always had like different style of players. Nurgle players were always the coolest guys. Just the most they were, like, low key. <laughs> yeah. They, the only problem is, is like, they would be incredible painters and they look great, or they'd be terrible painters. <laughs> it just still looks great because it's Nurgle. And it just looks, oh, it just looks <laughs> even worse. Like, they look like shit. I'm like, yeah. Um, like that's what I was I going for. Go for. <laughs> Let's see. Question: Is Anna uh, Lady Turin? She's not in the states. Uh, I'm actually going to Poland the first week of March, so I'm going to be out there for her birthday, and uh, she'll be coming out probably, hopefully, uh, end of March, April. That's the time frame. So we'll have to we'll have to come out and visit you, Gabo. I know. Uh, I'm out in Raleigh. My uh, we'll have to the fly day out you're and... leaving is the day my wife has to, my wife has to go for her interview to come to the state to to see a Sabaton uh, the Sabaton concert. You're yeah, the Sabaton that. concert is the same day that she's going to. Uh, she has to do her interview in Montreal. Yeah, yeah. So she's like, "Do you want to be with me?" I'm like, ah, "I just bought tickets it's like the day before." <laughs> oh, do you the really one need die. me to be there? <laughs> oh man, he took a one die there. He's he's playing risky. Look at the tickler just in the pits. Tickling. He hasn't tickled anyone. I'm I don't want to attack because I don't want to get lose that tackle box. But he does have mighty blow. He is, well, he is really stupid. Yeah, and he has no help near him too. Battle beards. All right. He got a little Ooh. something something going on there. Is he, oh, is he getting it? No. no, we're good. It's a ten. <laughs> it's up ten plus armor break, so that's like that's pretty hard for for anyone. Yeah, you you have to get like the goblin beatdown squad. Just all the rats just have to swarm them and just start kicking them. <laughs> Kick him at a kid. <laughs> oh man, I'm so blitzing that thrower with that niggling injury. Oh man, it's gonna be Gotham's reckoning in here. Uh, they they added a change to the Skaven team for tabletop. The the gun runners now come with weeping dagger, so they get plus one to injury rolls for like if they break a block or foul. Oh, okay. yeah, so they get like a little knife to start edging people with. <laughs> prison shank. <laughs> they have a little prison shank. He's running like he, he's running around the board, and you just have him shanking people. Dude, that's so great. <laughs> oh yeah, dude. I feel like I playing tabletop it. would be fun. Your dad plays it, right? Oh yeah, my dad. My dad's joining our league. I'm getting him on Discord this week, dude. <laughs> Gabo, Gabo's dad versus Turin, the showdown of the ages. And yes, make sure to. <laughs> Make sure to tune in for that one, guys. Buy your tickets now while on sale. It's gonna be it's gonna be a bloodbath. All right, we're moving up. We got the the Pestigor Rage Cage going. I just got to decide who I want to blitz. So if I blitz the, oh, I actually have a, yeah, Tickler would have to knock him down. Oh man, I could just blitz like this. Oh man, there's a lot of rats there. There's a couple options. I, I think I just see. honestly I can just ignore that blob really. I think he's yeah, a little overcommitted there. Uh, I don't want to like. Uh, give, I mean, I can see stuff. I don't want to influence the, the fight one way or the other. You're you're pretty. You picked this game up real quick. We're doing it. Thank you, man. Appreciate it. Oh, a dude. lot of people struggle. It is. It's it's a. Oh, I didn't get an injury. That guy had one of the issues too. I th I think uh, just for the sake of the people here, I gotta I gotta go for the the beast and Nurgle beatdown. He's turned hair oh. part of Ninja Hunt's beard now. <laughs> <laughs> That's pretty good. Dude, he's got a pretty gnarly beard. Oh no, I got really stupid. <laughs> the one time. Well, uh, if if you had taken like stanky leg and yeah, oh, I, I forgot it works like that. Yeah, yeah. yeah I don't okay. want to say anything. I totally forgot it works like that. Okay, so we got so, that. Because he's normally a four plus, just like trolls. But someone's next to him, he gets plus two to the roll. So yeah, I forgot high. about the difference with that. It's okay. It's, it shouldn't matter. So yeah, you've played for a while. Who are your favorite teams now, now that you kind of seen everything? I like playing Keyslove a lot. They're quite a bit of fun, just for like leisure. But uh, I mean, dwarves are so powerful. Like it, it doesn't. They have block. They're so forgiving. Playing dwarves is kind of like playing lizardmen in uh in Total War Warhammer Two. You know, it's just like lizardmen are so forgiving with like the cold blood layers and the rot rev crystals and just all that stuff. It's it's pretty it's pretty hog wild. Uh, there's a guy in the chat that says, uh, does Gobble Dad play orcs? And ironically, he does. <laughs> and then, let's see. Oh, your dad plays orcs? Yeah. He's although, like the father. Like, he started, like, he starts, he's been watching my channel, and, like, he's he's buying a goblin team for the tabletop yeah. just because of my goblins. Hell yes, dude. It's going to be glorious. Yeah. Oh, look at Anna's like, comment. <laughs> uh, my screen's really small. I'm pretty let's sure Turin had more hair. More hair on his head than the three sad pubes. <laughs> oh man, that's so good. I just give it up. I'm like, I'm just gonna shave it. I can't. Yeah. I can grow a mean mustache. I look like 
Burt Reynolds, but I can't. Dude, it. you're lucky, man. I can't do that. It's, I've nah, tried. Dude, you look like you look like some sleazy car salesman. Yeah. All you need is like the like the the, the jacket. You know, it's it's like, bad. Yeah, hey. just some like leather jacket that's all worn and has like stains all over it, and just You're like what's what's it gonna take for me to get you in this car? What's it gonna take? <laughs> God, man, I tried to grow mustaches a couple times, but it's just it's just uh, it's an abomination. I can grow long hair, like Jesus hair. Oh, he's gonna try and dodge. Oh, oh yeah, yeah. It's uh oh, getting... uh oh. It's well, what he's gonna do wrong. probably is use his rage cage to uh, or his wizard to try and bomb my my cage. I think what he's doing. Is uh like because you because you have higher armor like if, and he's he's engaging you which means like because the way blood bowl works is you can only do one blitz that means to move up and hit somebody so basically what, what it looks like to me is he's moving up to you and allowing you to get more hits on him I think he should just make it like a no touchy zone and force you to go to yeah him. and force me to use my blitzes to to yeah. get in there he should his he should delay you because you're not that fast no Nurgle's like, trying really to wait slow. for an opportunity. Oh, here comes Pound Town. Oh, oh, he's injured. Oh, he got he's him. injured. Down for the count. Oh, you got his knee, bro. Like Tanya Harding, he's coming. Yeah, in I there. just came in with a lead pipe. He oh. had a he had a promising career of being a figure skater. This was his last game before he retired. Just just so dark. <laughs> Blood Bowl is getting getting real sad now. Oh, dude. Okay, so oh, I there's a whole bunch of Blood Bowl novels. I keep wanting to read them. I just never have time. There's one about our Skaven who like ended up joining the team, didn't know he was part of it. <laughs> Dude, Skaven, Skaven are pretty ridiculous. Yeah, Skaven can get mutations though. If you roll doubles, you can get them. If you like, uh, you get uh, what are the most common ones? Like claws are probably the most common, but like disturbing presence is really good on the the gutter runners. I didn't know Skaven could get mutations. Yeah, yeah. Oh, foul appearance. That's it. If you get foul appearance, the same thing that you have on your Nurgle warriors. Yeah. And so you, so you give them foul appearance, so they spin the blitz, and that's a chance that they don't hit you. I did not know they could get that, actually. Yeah, they have to roll doubles, though. Okay. So it's like when if we get, like, an extra strength modifier, it's, like, the same thing, basically? Yeah, yeah. Same time you roll, like, because there's skills that everyone has. I think, like, your Chaos Warriors, they get general and strength. But if you roll doubles, you can give them an Agi skill. Well, for Skaven, if they roll double, they can get mutations. Although I think all those Chaos teams keep mutations for free when they level up. Got it. Uh oh, it's like Anna's getting into. Let's see, <laughs> Blood Bowl novels. What? She's getting in there. What's happening? What's happening? I'm out of the I loop. Okay, we're trying to take down the storm vermin. One day I'm gonna do a lore video. It's gonna be all about the Blood Bowl. <laughs> Dude, that'd be good. Yeah, because it's like a whole alternate history, isn't it? Well, I'll, I'll, I'm not gonna say the Blood Bowl is better, but I will say this, and in, in the Blood Bowl timeline. Age of Sigmar never happens. That's all I'm saying. <laughs> I think that instantly <laughs> settles the debate. Here we yeah, go. That's, oh, down that's you filthy awesome. rat! Oh, this guy has the the injury problem too. Oh, dude, you can't get you can't get Riley or whatever his name is <laughs> out there giving him the stanky leg. Dude, oh, is that was that stanky leg? <laughs> yeah, yeah, stanky he needs, leg. Stanky legs. He's the newest addition because I actually had someone die on me last week. So stanky legs like new and improved here. Oh, wow, dude. You had a guy die? Yeah, it was pretty sad. Don't you all you do is have, like, regeneration? Yeah, I failed the regeneration roll. It was, it was pretty depressing. Oh, that's sad. My, Lehman Russ asks, are you excited about Vermintide 2? Yes, man. We're going to be playing that, right? Oh, 100% we're going to be playing that. You got it. It's going to be great. We'll have to get you, me, and Anna. And Anna could be, like, because they have a shade, right? Like, a Dark Elf shade now? Uh, yeah, well, the, the, the Way Watcher or whatever, the, the Elf can now be a Way Watcher. A shade or like a handmaiden, I think. Who are so you? you basically be a high elf, dark elf, or what else? Oh, oh, <laughs> he used his wizard. He tried. Did you see that? So he used a wizard there, guys. So basically, every character in the blast radius takes a four up, and I resisted it with most of them, I think. Yeah, just power mold. Yeah, it, it looks down. like uh, ACDC got knocked down, though. <laughs> he got thunderstruck. <laughs> <laughs> that actually is so fitting. Oh, man. <laughs> well, he, he used a fireball. I, I think I would have used the lightning. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, the fireball. I would have been all cool, Garth though. Brooks in there. Stop when a lightning strikes. <laughs> Garth Brooks, oh my god. Yeah, isn't that one of his songs? Yeah, it is, it is. <laughs> hey, Dov, thanks for the donate. New Dov pays, guys. It's The, the debate is finally settled. Dov, Dov makes some sort of racket. He's always dropping two bucks here and there. Dov, Dov's a, he, he, true, to his, uh, true to his creed. All right. Anna's, so what are you doing Anna, here? are you selling pictures of my terrible beard from summer? 
If you guys want to see the beard picture, you have to go through Anna. She's the dealer. You have to pay her. <laughs> yeah, I tried to get into the beta for Vermintide. I yeah, they haven't got like, given it to me yet. Everyone's playing it in our Discord, and we're just in the we're just in the <laughs> other room, just all sad. <laughs> yeah, we're like, oh, come on, guys. They're like, no, you can't play. Dude, they just hate us. They probably looked at our channels like these guys suck. <laughs> hey, thank so you, true, thank though. you, thank you. I'm glad you like the haircut, creature caster. I, I was worried that I would lose my mojo, but like, I don't. Good. You kind of look like Macklemore to me. Yeah, yeah. I've got Macklemore, but you know who people really say is Rick who? Astley, the never gonna give you up guy. Go to <laughs> Google and type in Rick Astley, never gonna give you up. I think I look like him a little bit. Just he has more red hair, but I mean, yeah, Macklemore, I guess is the more. Dude, that meme happens. like brought his career back out of nowhere. Yeah. Oh yeah, he's like performing at like parades and stuff now. Like it's it's madness. That he went from like being a nobody to just getting it. Yeah. <laughs> well, he was like, he was like a uh, popular in the '80s. I know. Yeah, it was like out of nowhere, people just started Rick rolling. Yeah, like 30 yeah. years later, you know, that video. Well, I mean. He said he was going to never give you up. Dude, didn't. I know. I, I actually enjoyed that song. Like, before it became a meme, like, I didn't listen to it or go out of my way, but I was like, oh, I kind of like that, like, when it came on. <laughs> when you're in the grocery store shopping, you're like, oh, I like this one. Yeah. Oh, man. I found this YouTube. That's how I... Oh, go ahead. Oh, go ahead. I was going to say, that's how I know I'm old. Like, I'm a... I'll be at the store, like, I'm like, man, I got to buy some sausages and some sauerkraut. <laughs> sauerkraut. And then, like, as I listen to the music around, like, the Harris Teeter I shop at. Yeah. Like all the songs, like oh, I know this song. Oh, that song's not that old. And I think they're like that song was like 2004. Oh man, the new metal days. I feel like every time we cast something together, there's always new metal gets brought up, like Limp Bizkit. <laughs> oh, <laughs> well, I mean, last game. Well, last game we had a breach for it. Are we gonna break stuff? Yeah. Well, you can try it, man. I mean, you don't have a chainsaw like me. No, no. Your team is truly the avatar of Limp Bizkit. You know, it truly is. What's oh, it? Oh, someone got an internship. Hey, thank you for the donation and the sponsorship, man. You guys are generous, Anthony. All right, I'm never gonna give you up, Macklemore. <laughs> oh, I hope that doesn't become a thing with me, like being Macklemore now. I hate Macklemore music. No, I I listen like I caught the thrift songs, right? It's I'm it like, is oh. catchy. I'm like I like it, you know. It's just the guy being obnoxious in a thrift store. I'm like, that's funny, right? Yeah. And uh, next thing I know, like I'm like, okay, let me let's hear what else he has. And I'm like, he's not that good. Yeah, no, so I, I like him. I can't get into his other stuff, that's for sure. And um, yeah, Jesse uh, Tejeda, to answer your question, we do have a league that's open to everyone that we actively play in. Um, if someone in chat, uh, Anna or Dov, any of you guys can give them a link to our Discord channel. We all we play pretty actively in there. So, Gamba, oh, yeah, there's Gamba, a lot of some scary looking. teams. Yeah, I think I think we're gonna open up the season because uh, it seems to be getting a pretty good reaction. People want to see the teams. Yeah. It's, it's, I think I think part of it is that people like the personalities. Yeah, absolutely. So they, they can get behind it. Like Professor Pone's like my this champion of the league right now. <laughs> the halflings. Oh, oh he's he's such a funny dude. He's so great. I know. I, I we always tell him he should have a channel, but he just won't do it, man. He needs a stand up routine. He needs to just get out there and just and just do it. Quit his job protecting serving and just get out there and just start talking we, we could be his managers just like his sleazy managers just promoting him dude you gotta grow that mustache if you're gonna do that i think anna's anna might be showing people pictures now i'm not sure she's gathering offers oh i had a horrible mustache when i lived in poland over the summer it was just an atrocity i think the word you were looking for is glorious <laughs> badass <laughs> All right, but yeah what he's doing right now um we're gonna take this game like i think he, he's giving you like he's fighting the game you want to yeah, play. yeah he's, like. he's getting a little brawly with me so Val Nier, I think he just needs to step away. Just, just walk away from this fight. Oh man, his thrower here is getting taken to Pound Town. You ready for this? Ooh. Oh Amazing. no injuries, damn. Okay. We're just working our way down the Skaven line and just cleaving their skulls. You're just working your way downtown. Making my way downtown. Yeah. <laughs> Watch the uh oh. Oh, nothing. Okay, he's stunned. Didn't you have a rule for your team? Like if you kill somebody, they join your team. It's like Yeah, so if I kill someone, they become one of Nurgle's rotters. Which is pretty great. <laughs> hey, Gary, thanks for sharing the link. A young John Waters. I've never been told that before, but I'll take it. A young John Waters? Could be much worse. I, I don't look like anybody cool. No. Uh, I mean, I look probably most like LL Cool J. Dude, that's that's cool. What are you talking about? Uh, I mean, I mean that's pretty cool. But Mama said knock you out? Yeah, I get, I get, a lot of people like confuse me for LL Cool J quite often. <laughs> Just in the mean streets? 
Yeah. yeah. I mean, we, we have a lot of similar history. You know what I'm talking about? Yeah. Like, same same life struggles and You know, background. I'm fierce like a shark, deep blue sea. Oh, the goat ram. Uh oh. <laughs> oh, my God. He has the ball, too. He just, just, he just whacked him with, with it. The ball. No, nothing could beat the halflings with their shanks of meat, though, just beating on people. No, Anna, don't share these pictures, please. Oh, it's oh. too late. She's, she's sharing, like... She's putting me on blast with my filthy mustache. Is it just you with, like, a towel on, like, the rope? They right gotta now? pay. They gotta pay extra price for that. <laughs> they gotta pay a premium. All right. Um, I think we just take this... I think I should have a decent bash over here somewhere. Yeah, I have to stand this rotter up to get a two die. That's kind of... I don't want to get surfed. Although, it's just... It's Kielbasa. He can take it. We're standing him up. I think yeah. this... I think I can get this dude eye pretty efficiently here. Yeah, that's fine. Down you I go. Think, I, think, I think he's pretty safe. Like, what is he going to do? Yeah, those little rats can't. They're looking pretty mangled right now. <laughs> Without the rat ogre, they can't bash that well. I, I, they can only get two blitzers. So. I, and it, I look like Uncle right. Frank, who ruins every family party and tells Aunt Janice her food is shit. <laughs> what? Oh, come on. I don't say that all the time. Oh, man. <laughs> Oh, I'm so glad that link didn't work. <laughs> she just went to click it. I think she uploaded to like Imager. Um, so Red Spotted Drake has a question for you, Gabo. He says, "What is Gabo's favorite sausage flavor?" Oh God, dude, I like the spicy Italians. Spicy Italians. Uh, gosh, it's like you know, like I love. Okay, let me know when it's too much. I love all sausages. Dude, uh, yeah, hell yeah, man. Like, like, and like, I'm talking like real ones. I can watch it make. Some people can't watch it being made. I can. not yeah, I want that. Cap. You like the whole That's process, cool. like the the whole package. Oh yeah, like um, if it's a, not like hot dogs, like if it's a real sausage, like give me, ah, oh, just all over it, just get it, just pour that mustard all over my face. Anna, Anna will have to, Anna and I will have to smuggle you some kielbasa from Poland so you can truly live. It's, <sighs> she, oh man, she treated me so well when I was living over there. Like her dad would go to the local butcher shop and just get the like handmade kielbasa and. Then they would bring it over. Oh, it was so good. I used to just lay there. It was just like a fat pot belly, just eating it on my side. And just like, oh, yes, I can't stop. Like, you just, you see, like, you, you, your belly sticking out. Yeah. Oh, you're dude, like, for showing sure. your midriff. You're like, Anna. <laughs> Anna. Help me. I can't get up. Kibasa. Oh, yeah. She's roll down your face. <laughs> Kibasa. She treats me so well, for sure. Oh, well, I always went to Poland. Like, when I was in the Middle East, like, you were flying to Poland. Like, I just happened to be, we were, me and my wife, like, let's go somewhere. Uh, on our way back, maybe someday uh, we'll have a we'll have a grand party in Poland. Yeah, maybe and I don't like I have no reason to go to Europe right now. We'll fly out there when we're all rich from doing YouTube. We'll just like yeah. take a vacation. I don't want to brag, but my video made a dollar seventy seven. Dude, today. that's fat. <laughs> that's super fat. Nice. Man. I can buy I can buy like a a, a soda. <laughs> oh, look at that! You see the roll? <laughs> Got that double. Oh, oh crap, dude! That's right. Yeah, because now if he wants to get crazy, he can blitz my rotter there and take him out of bounds. He can. I don't know if that's worth it, though. I mean, oh, you had to pick one. Oh, okay, yeah. That's right. I was, like, waiting. I was like, huh. Uh, I, was talking to, I was talking to Black Iron today. He's got to run the league. And he's like, you know, at first I was just kind of joking around. But now uh, I, need to start, I need to start playing hard. I don't think I'm going to make the finals. <laughs> yes. The commissioner of our league is uh, Black Iron. So... After this game, guys, we'll, we'll go ahead and go over to, like, the, the this week's standings, and I'll show you guys, like, the breakdown and the leaderboard so you guys can see where we're at. Also, another thing, uh, we're going to be doing some head-to-head uh, -head campaign streams this weekend and also maybe a quick battle stream tomorrow. So, and Gabo can snipe me and just and just take me out as usual. It'll be great. I'm going to try. <laughs> Janet, Janet and Cajun and I, we're, we're starting our second channel, and Dude, we're going to try to get some recording done is it up, Is it up yet, the channel? No, we're gonna, it's going to take us about a month because we want, like, a month worth of videos before we start pushing it yeah that's good we found one game i can't remember what it's called but like you have a walkie talkie and so you have to like talk over it and of course i was communications section for marines yeah i'm like oh this is perfect but it's like it's like a puzzle game but you have to talk to, like so i'm in one room and he's in a different room and he has to like work his way out and there's a what is keep it talking called? To, uh it's called like we were you and there's another one called keep talking and nobody explodes where like one guy has the bomb manual and the other guy oh, has Oh, that game looks bomb. so stressful, dude. That game gave me anxiety just looking at oh, it. Oh, dude, we're playing it. Oh, you know my it's God. Going. Dude. I, I, I'm excited to see that. What's the channel called? It's not up yet. Uh, like, we have an official name, but it's probably going to be Janet and Gabo or Jag for short. 
<laughs> I like it. <laughs> we're gonna get we're gonna get going because like as it as it stands now, we're just if we have so much fun just talking on YouTube and just having a good time and meeting people, they're like, why don't we just play the games we want to play anyways and just making videos of it. Dude, it's gonna be like Game Grumps 2.0. <laughs> oh the, my god, it'd be too funny. Jan is an artist. He went to art school. He showed me some of his why are we not drawing stuff for our channel? Yeah. I figure what he needs is like, I need to be like an angry that's like getting rained on and he needs to be like a British skeleton with like a mustache and a big top <laughs> hat and an umbrella. Yeah. <laughs> oh my God, dude. I love it. Yeah, I'm excited. He's to see a good that, guy though. Good yes, guy. he is. He's a good, he's a good lad. So here's the question. Are you going to run down the clock? Or I'm going to beat, beat these guys for a couple turns for sure. Yeah, because <laughs> when you're playing Skaven, I think Skaven's a really good team. Now, I, like, yeah, as soon as they get the ball, they can game. score. So I need to pound town them. Yeah. Skaven can do one uh, one turn touchdowns. I think I just take this both down, to be honest. Although, no, because then I'm going to uh, get... He doesn't have anybody with the one turn touchdown, though. But they're fast, dude. They're so fast. I need to fight off the sideline here. Otherwise, I would have taken that. I don't want to get my guy surfed. It doesn't need uh, to happen. He's, he's going to push him into the crowd. No, he's not. The worst part is too, like if he pushes like Kilbasa, he's pushing him right into his dugout. So it's just going to be all the guys at baseball bats just swinging at him. <laughs> not if not if Kilbasa has anything to say about it. Okay. No. Oh man, that didn't go well. Okay, we're just going to stay. You can't take the Kilbasa. Nobody can take the sausage. <laughs> well, I mean, I think I admitted earlier that <laughs> I, I have a lot of experience taking sausages. Oh no! Did did Anna did Anna get the picture out? Oh, dude, is it terrible? Let me look. <laughs> oh no, I think I know what picture it is. Oh, uh, is it is it the one where you're like doing the slob squat? I'm probably with, like, squatting bow? on like a log in the forest and just like, oh, it's not working for me. Uh, well, I'll have to check it later in Discord. What a disappointment! Isn't there one of you like you squatting with like some? Uh... <laughs> What yeah. is it called? Like some Strongbow Cider or something? Yeah, there, there's a couple. That I, I've squatted a couple places in Poland. Um, my form's pretty good. I think Anna approves. I got the perfect... Because the most important thing about the Slav squat, from my perception as a filthy American spy, is that uh, is that like the heels need to be flat on the ground. You can't be on your toes when you're squatting. It needs to be perfectly flat. Otherwise, it's kind of like cheating. <clears throat> I noticed that like the squat... Is it very much an Eastern European and uh, no, sorry, Western European and American thing? Like not squatting. Everywhere else in the world squats. Like when I was in Japan and Thailand, and just working with guys like in Vietnam and stuff. Yeah. Like we would have to go do something, and they would just like, oh, this is a good spot. They would just squat down and just start doing their work. Yeah, yeah. It's my high school. I went to a boarding school, and uh, oh, 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 uh, <laughs> well, crazy. Having done, uh, sent us or sent us, well, <laughs> sent you two pounds. We shall distribute it. Thank you for the donation, you and Gabo and mullets for money. You know, I actually thought about getting a mullet, like before I fully cut my hair, I was gonna be like, can you cut my mullet so I can have this for like three days and then from there we go. Um, this Joe Dirt. <laughs> Anna says, my job here is now done. Now that you've shared my mustache pic, I'm just gonna go to pasture and nurglings now. Oh my God, I just got wrecked so hard. Nurglings are my favorite models in all fantasy and 40K. Dude, they're so good. Like, the, could you have this evil juggernaut lord like Nurgle and like flies coming out of him, yeah. pus and a scythe, and there's like this little Nurgling who's like smiling, like taking a selfie. <laughs> just or an evil cackle. <laughs> He's just like hee hee. They're so mischievous. They're kind of like goblins almost a little bit, right? Yeah, I, I, I imagine like little gremlins. Like you ever watch Looney Tunes? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> that's how I see Nurglings. They're like, they're like purple Nurgle just wants you to be happy and have a friend. Yeah. So everybody gets a little Nurgling to like make them smile. All right, it's time. Yeah, it's it's kind of like I was having this, uh, one sec. All right, Anna, take care, darling. I love you. And uh, feel free to share more mustache pics. Um, <laughs> what was I going to say? Freaking, yeah, so, like, I was kind of thinking, like, you know, the, with the Emperor and 40K and everything, like, like on his Golden Throne, you know, probably know the lore, but doesn't he, like, just basically, like, take the souls and, like, energy of, like, thousands of people a day just to stay, like, sentient and alive? Yeah, so they to keep him alive on his Golden Throne. Yeah. They have to feed him psychers. So if you're if you're like a psyker in the Imperium and like, you know, like you know, like the X Men, everyone has like mutant powers. Like, oh, this guy can heal and this guy can, you know, do whatever. Yeah. Like, so if you're a psyker and all you can do is like, I can see ten seconds in the future, you're getting fed to the Emperor. 
Yeah, I'm like, I mean, that's, I feel like that's way worse than like, even what some of the chaos gods do, right? You're just like, oh, no, like, you're, you're probably better going off to chaos because, like, your options are if you're a low level, you're getting, if you're a higher level one, then you're going to be stuck inside the ship and they lock you inside a room and you're basically like, you're used to navigate because that's how the ships, uh, in 40k or the imperial ships get around is they, they use Terra, the Emperor, as their beacon. Got it. And so, like, they just basically sit there tormented by demons all day, every day. That's terrible. <laughs> oh, my God. This is like no, there's, like, no good part of 40K. Yeah, it's all pretty grim dark. I mean, of all the 40K races, which one would you say is, like, the most, al like, altruistic or even close to being, like, decent? Um, God, Nurgle. Like, he just wants to love you. Yeah, I feel like he treats his followers, I mean, because they don't actually suffer, despite the fact that they're afflicted, right? They just kind of, like... Yeah, I mean, if you're okay being a fat slob... Yeah, with like you know pustulants coming out and being bloated, yeah, you're good. It probably doesn't but, even like hurt them though, right? Yeah, like they're just, nah, they're just nah, no case. He's just he just wants to give you his gifts. Yeah, <laughs> he's just like treat yourself. I mean, Eldar is probably good up until the point you die, in which case your soul gets eaten. Isn't it by uh, Slanesh or something? Yeah, Slanesh. That's how the Eye of the Terror and stuff kind of form. So that's so all the Eldar have little soul gems on them. So when they die, you got to grab the, the your your soul goes into the gem. Jeez. Otherwise, so Nesh is like dinner time. Turn's mustache looks like a twirl in Wild West villain. <laughs> oh, yeah, it was so bad. I'm glad you guys are enjoying it. And thanks again for all of you guys for joining today. But yeah, D Dan's right. Like, I'm, I'm giving you like the cliff notes of, of, of lore right now. <laughs> no, it's good. That, People should... say that Tal Empire is good, but Tal Empire is like big brother, man. You got to... <laughs> you're you're just, just buying into the propaganda, dude. That's what the globalists want you to believe. That's so good. Orcs are the good boys. Okay, right? Yeah, I feel like orcs' life is. Yeah, they're not like. They, do they treat each other badly aside from just some bra bar brawls every now and then? I mean, I mean, if you're okay, like, oh, you'd be fine because you played high school football, so like, you know exactly how. Yeah, yeah, it's just kind of like that, and like, you know, kind of that shared animosity that if there's nothing going on, you can kind of get tense with your roommate, or you know someone you know it's it's we found chaos well chaos cultists yeah no i'm a big fan i play death guard in 40k so uh, yeah. oh no mountain dew had oh, it got him with the one die i but, guess you know, he's just trying to hit your dudes i mean he can't really stop you at this point no no i can just sit there i just got to make sure i actually score next turn <laughs> yeah i might just go in but i feel like i should really pound some of these caven but i i don't know if i had to be one of them i'll probably orc I feel yeah. like that'd be the safest one to be. Or Tyranid. Like, I'm just part of the hive mind, you know. Go eat that dude. I'd be like, okay. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Tyranid, Tyranid are like hive mind, right? Oh, yeah. Tyranid are hive mind. They used to be like a fringe. They used to be like a little fringe, like small, little, like, oh, like sickly race. This is Rogue Trader. And then they retconned it all. And that's that's also how they wrote out the, the squats. They're like, oh, the squats got eaten by Tyranids. <laughs> the dwarf. All right, space dwarves. Them. We've had enough. Yeah. The Rattlings, uh, the Rattlings, the 40k Halflings, right? They got wiped out by, uh, they almost got wiped out by uh, Abaddon, who's like their version of Archeon. Yeah, yeah, Abaddon the Despoiler. Yeah. Is he, what's and his I'm legion? Like, he's Black Legion. He, he took over oh. after Horus went down. I love the sound of the yeah, I heard he's pretty good. I think he like has really strong synergy with Chaos Cultists, like he makes him uh, fearless and stuff. Uh, I haven't read his rules for this uh, edition, but yeah, he, he, he has uh, the claw of Horus. He has Horus's claw. So Horus had like two lightning claws. He has one of them. And then his other weapon is a demon sword. Yeah. This is a sword with a demon locked into it. It's all gangster. Yeah. I feel like being a gene sword would be pretty fun. <laughs> now, what are those? I, I've seen them, but I don't even know what they really are. They're the Xenos monster, for, like, in a long story short. Are they they're Tyranid? The, yeah, they're Tyranid. They're like the movie Aliens. Yeah, they're like hybrids, right? Though they don't they have like some human characteristics about them. Yeah, um, they're they're kind of humanish. I think I've seen pictures of it, but I don't know. The, the lore has changed a few times. Are you not running it in on the last turn? I am. I'm it, just pounding. It, I got an injury actually, on uh, on the tickler, because I have a re I have two rerolls, so I'm kind of like you know, if, I'd have yeah. to get pretty unfortunate to. Uh, like, I do like what they did with the Gene Slayer Colt in 40k though. Have you seen those models? Just like minor. <laughs> yeah, they're pretty freaky looking. But, but like their old rules for them, my dad played jeans. Oh. No. They, they would have lim they would have limos, <laughs> limousines. <laughs> yeah, they had limousines and like they would roll up and like your your patriarch would get out with like all the jeans stealers. Dude, that's just <laughs> a pimp wagon.
<laughs> oh, yeah, this is like old, old school. This is like second edition stuff. In the dark days. That's it, boys. Yeah. We scored. A bunch of injured Skaven. <laughs> so uh, what do you think went well for you on the half there? Well, I think I think it became a brawl, which is not what he wants. Nah. But um, he's got he's got to be down a couple players now. So four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So how many did you start with? Eleven. Eleven. So he's down two. Okay. He can make he can make stuff happen. Uh, yeah. The only downside though, for him is like, he he has the ability to be a really good throwing team. Yeah. But because you have so much uh, was it disturbing presence. Yeah. On all these chaos warriors. Yeah. You can basically zone out all the spots that he can get. I'm just going to play ultra conservative here because Skaven, like, if you guys look at the gutter runners, they have movement nine, which is pretty insane, and dodge. So that they're like, they can slip away. Like, my fastest is six. So he can really, like, make some distance on me. Oh, Chaos Warriors. I found spot. for oh, well. Blood Bowl, like, people always equate it to, like, rugby and football, but a closer to me is actually playing it like uh, basketball, like man to man defense. Yeah, yeah. Like you, you, you being slower, you want to play that man to man because you want to force him to make rolls. Want that Shaq defense? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, Sk he could still score though for sure. Oh yeah. The boy must watch. He, he could, Let's see. He he can get downfield. Like he can drop a guy onto the left and right. I would not give you a free fight. I would stay away from the tickler. <laughs> and like, just like load up on the left or right side of my three guys and just like shoot downfield i would miss make you run around dude i've seen i've seen your your treacherous play with the goblins i i'm really not looking forward to fighting your chainsaw like that's something i dread <laughs> i'm like <laughs> professor oh dude my bombardier was like hero game last, uh, yeah. yesterday if anyone here in chat if you guys want to see a really entertaining game go to the Goblin king's channel uh he actually had a game with goblins versus uh who were you fighting again last night they're t camry i mean camry, tomb, tomb kings. kings and it was insane there's like trolls eating things. It's just uh, it got pretty bananas. Oh yeah, we troll ate a goblin. We we had a hot potato with a grenade. Like it was just it madness. Was, let's see. Anna says, "Yeah, you guys. Anna Anna's right. You guys need to go to Italian Spartacus channel and tell him to face me in head to head." She made the. Did I show you the thumbnail she made, Gabo? Oh no, yeah. I'll, I'll show you after this. I I wanted to keep it a surprise until the stream, but it's too good to. Is, she, it, is it really good? It's so good. She has like treaches like a Pokemon. <laughs> it's, I choose you. It's so good. It's so good. And she like drew me and Ryan, and it's like, oh man, it's glorious. It's so good. Yeah, I'll, I'll show you. Okay, so the Skaven is it my turn already? Oh no, I thought he screwed something up. No, no, he's he's getting his stuff going. All right, let's see what the Skaven can do. Let's see if our boy Valnir can can go ham here. Yeah, I feel like Valnir is the guy who used to play orc. He's playing very orc like. Very bashy. Yeah. Yeah. And, I mean, it's it's a way to play. Skaven you just can't play because like all their guys are seven move, right? Yeah. And look at your guys. They're all like five, and four, six, four. <laughs> so oh, his guys, for... his slowest guys is seven. He wow, he's trying to take out it. Stanky Leg. You see this? Oh, he's going for it. He got him down. Oh, he got him down. The boy's down. Don't follow. Don't push it. Yeah, you go. Push him out. Uh, let's see. I'd be a Plague Marine. <laughs> Plague Marine's ball sweat. <laughs> what? <laughs> uh. I, I think he is Niarl. I think he's aware of yeah, that. Yeah, well, I mean, the the thing is, they're all Night Goblin, and my team just happens to have a lot of extra starch. Uh, I didn't even think about the. I got a, I picked my team for the white and red because I have like a, a special skin that's the has blood splatter all over the the dudes. That's halftime, bros. So, what are your thoughts on this half so far, Gabo? <laughs> yeah, I, I think he was. Man, he's just playing a little too bashy. Like, he needs just needs to step away. Yeah. Play a little more defensively. Uh, like, if you have your team set up here, I, I think he needs to get a guy away from the tickler because he'll never get away from him. Yeah, he wants so to he be takes, in a, like, Yeah, he needs to be in a situation where I can't get a two wrap on him. Because yeah. if I just, if I get, you know, power mullet or if I, yeah, if I'm able to get the tickler in a two, like, he's, he's already down three players, so he could potentially lose two more permanently. They're not getting away from tickler. So what he could do, like, I, don't, I mean, it all depends on how, how well he knows the game and how, how risky he's feeling. But he could get, like, his gunner runners on the left and right. And since you don't have any tackle zones on the very edges, yeah, he could just run down field. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. He can get, like, three spaces behind your Pestigors. And then he, all he has to do is make a dodge, you know, and then he could potentially score. Yeah, and then that way he's set up for next turn. And he can just... You know, figure out where he needs to throw the ball and get that touchdown. Uh, can rat ogres throw rats, uh, Matthew? No, they can't. Uh, the only people that can throw are the trolls, the trees, 
and ogres can throw. Dude, that'd and be the so only great people they can throw. Rats. Yeah, the only people who can be thrown are guys that have uh, the right stuff trait, and only noblars, halflings, and goblins have the right stuff. The right stuff. Hey, Red Spotted oh, Drake, right? thanks for the donation, man. Cheers. Oh, that's right. It's Chinese New Year's, the year of the dog. It is. I got I got dog tattoos. Do you have a tattoo of a dog? Really? Yeah, I have. I have. Uh, I got two dogs tattooed onto my right arm. It's like I was like 21, fucking, <laughs> you know, badass yeah. and all. Yeah. But it's all Celtic knot work. That's cool. What, what, I mean, are they like uh... one? Because like I was like a buck 35 when yeah. I got that tattoo, and now I'm like 170. Yeah. I put on a little bit of muscle, so my biceps grow. <laughs> They're just all jacked now. Yeah. So like one dog, one dog looks normal, but he's the one on the back side, the tricep. His triceps just don't get as huge. Yeah. <laughs> On some people, yeah, it depends. Yeah. Oh, he got I'm just me down one of again. Those guys. Ooh, he's living dangerous. Yeah, he's he's. Man, if I like, can get Tickler in that spot right to the left of uh, that guy, man, I'm gonna get like three of those guys. So I probably just push off his uh, his patch with a uh, power mullet, and then. Although I, I don't know, he he might. I have enough back. I have so many more players. It's gonna be hard. Uh, he might be trying to play a little bit of a long game, like. To me, I wouldn't be worried because uh, I don't know if I would have stacked the two gutter runners back there. I would have ran them deep line yeah. because your guys are so slow that none of you can even catch the thrower. So I wouldn't be worried about you getting the ball from me. Oh, oh, got him. <laughs> Brutal. Misses next game. He has a gouge die. <laughs> oh, that's not good. Oh, Who's man. He playing next game? I don't know. He's, he's, oh, he's got... playing. Uh, he's not playing black guard. He's playing Sotek, I think. I might get tabled here, man. I don't know. We still have... <laughs> All right, so let's go ahead and just try and get this guy off here. We're going to take him down. Then we're going to we're going to do this a little bit, a little bit of this. Come on, power mullet. Oh, you didn't use the tickler? No, no. Tickler is uh, getting a fat tickle box over here. <laughs> oh, yeah. You're just... <laughs> just, slap just look at him cackling. <laughs> oh. Oh, oh, man. He's so top heavy. He is. He's so disgusting. Oh, oh my god, dude! Have you seen the new? I've, you've seen the new models for the uh, the Tickler, right? The Beast of Nurgle in 40k. Yeah. 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 They're cool. Oh my god! I laugh every time I see it. It just makes me so happy. Oh yeah, that's right. I made the I made the picture, the meme of you. You did. <laughs> it's so good. It's just they're just always screaming. They're like ah. They're pretty freaky looking. Oh my god. So. There's like two models in 40k that every time I see it, I just laugh. I just, I'm, I'm in tears because of how stupid I think they are. Gabba, you ready They're to see? Chaos. You ready to see another character get sacrificed to the tickler? Uh oh, are you pushing him in? I'm pushing him into the pits. <laughs> Down you go to the tickler. <laughs> I feel like tickler needs a little support now, though. He's pretty over overwhelmed there, so let's just throw a router in there. I don't want him to get even uh, a one die. Rezo, Rezo says he's trying to donate, but somehow he can't uh, he can't send you a super chat. Yeah, yeah, no worries, Rezo. Really appreciate it though, man. So yeah, YouTube can control for sure. Let's see, do we want to? Yeah, it's. He has the ball. How fast is his his throw? He's okay. So he's movement seven. Oh yeah, Skaven are a fast teammate. Like, you got to be penetrating that backfield, Skaven. Yeah, I'm gonna send a couple guys to get balls deep in there. And then we're going to probably play deep coverage with the other three. I think we got to play a little... Like, I just need to just keep bashing that goon squad he has there. Like, I can just sur literally surf him down the line next yeah, yeah. turn. Well, that's what I mean. Like, he's playing into your advantage now. Because, he like, as he stacked that deck, you're able, now now he's in a slugfest. And you just have higher armor. It's going to be pound town for sure. Yeah. It's happening. All right, that's it for the turn. That's that's why my goblin survives. Like as soon as I get in a situation like that, I'm like, I'm just gonna walk well, away. As soon as I yeah, as soon as there's a fight, you every single do goblin is dodging out. And they have stunty too. Do these guys have stunty? No, they, they don't have stunty. I, I feel like they should. They're pretty tiny, aren't they? Well scaven are Yeah, but they're not like Stunty also uh you you're more likely to get injured. I think it's plus one on the injury roll. Yeah, and if you look at Screeble, like the guy in the middle there, his Skaven, like if he stood up straight and wasn't hunching, he'd be almost as big as that rotter, which is basically human sized. Yeah, but he's a dirty rat. <laughs> he's a filthy rat. Where's your plague furnace warp lightning cheese now? Yeah, where are them doom wheels at? Oh, man. Why do they not have a doom wheel as a special weapon in this? That would be so cool. <laughs> like the steamroller for the dwarves? Oh, dude, that thing's a monster. What's he doing? It's a secret there? weapon, though. Dude, what treachery is afoot? I think he's just trying to run from food truck. 
Yeah, he needs. I mean, I would take that sting rain. I would take both of them and just run downfield because you can only blitz once, right? The one in the gutter runner is gonna make it. Yeah, one of the boys will live. Yeah, we'll see. Exactly. But yeah, he's he's not gonna get past the wall. <laughs> no, the tickler is is just just an execrable force with a tackle box on three scave, and he's down three players basically. Like the chances of getting yeah. away are so low with the tentacles. Yeah, and if, as long as you keep, like, a rotter next to him, he won't be able to beat him up. Yeah, because I get the strength modifier. He's going to have to get so many dice. He doesn't have enough players, I don't think. Dude, the tank was about to level up. Dude, I know. At the end of the game, I'll go for some fights. Oh, okay. All right. A little something-something. You're stealing no, my tackle not box. AC. Yeah. ACDC's got a touchdown. I'm impressed. He did, yeah. That was against, uh, I think it was against Italian. Oh, we don't we don't play until, like, the last game of the season. You and I? Oh, yeah, we're pretty late in the season. Oh, no. <laughs> He's probably going to get injured. <laughs> it's just done. No, it's just done. He's, he's all right. All right, now we start to put put our, uh, put our the clamps on. The Nurgle. Nurgle's pestilent glory. Yeah, why do you call him food truck? Like, well, I, got food, I actually got food poisoning from a food truck once. <laughs> so I figured he's disgusting and rotted and, you know, it's kind of... Yeah, it's just like the most disgusting stuff ever. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Okay, so we're, we're taking a high high road here a little bit, too. Uh, no, there are not loot boxes in this game. No. Thankfully. They're Although not. I hear, like, Madden or the, uh, NBA 2K has loot boxes, and I just can't figure out how that works. Surf him <laughs> down the line, brother. Oh. He's about to take a little trip. Well, I want to get him to the tickler, so I'm just kind of, like, working it slowly. Well, this guy is... Definitely pound town material. So let's stand up. This guy, I forgot to do that. ACDC needs to get up. Yeah, he's got, I wonder if there's any dodge. song, if there's any song you and I could sing that would get us demonetized because it was so close to the actual thing. Pretty much any Whitney Houston. <laughs> Dude, that's brutal. I couldn't, I couldn't hit those notes. I don't know what you're talking I can't, about. I can't make high notes anymore, man. I used to be able to like make these like little laser noises like pew pew. And yeah. I can't do it. Like after I went to boot camp, I just screamed so much that my <laughs> voice vocal cords are just changed. shot. Dude, boot camp, that's so funny looking back at it. I have so many stories from it. But, but yeah, yeah, like your job basically is just to run around and scream. Like, it's amazing. It's the <laughs> easiest job in, your wor in the world. Yeah. <laughs> oh, man. The, the good old oh. days. Oh, dude, it's like I'm getting paid to run around and scream. I get food. Like, just don't be an idiot. And you're fine. Yeah. You're in that, man. Of course, I'm an idiot, so I wasn't fine. <laughs> <laughs> We're going for Queek It. Oh, I know that gets him out of the tick the tickle box, but I just I couldn't resist. Uh, it, he's agi three. He has no dodge stuff anyway. Like okay, yeah, it's, go it's pretty unlikely he's gonna get out of there. You know, I could actually just punch this guy, and that would yeah. You know, let's just do that. Okay, let's... Uh, gas, oh, gas gas station oh. sushi. The tickler, he's coming in with the tickle. <laughs> <laughs> he just kind of body checks him. I haven't even blitzed yet. Let's do that too. Oh, uh, dude, we gotta play Bordheim. They have a Nurgle team from do Bordheim. They? Yeah, it's called the Carnival of Chaos. Sounds fun. And to like, me, you can get Nurgling, and like, they're like little Nurglings in like little clown outfits. <laughs> That's so great. <laughs> oh my god. I don't know if they have it. I know they have it for tabletop. I don't know if they have it for the computer game. But they have it for the computer game. It is on sale. But we gotta get we gotta get a leak going. Oh, dude. And yeah, the new computer version. So yeah, there is a more time computer game coming out. So it's like Warhammer kind of RPG turn based. We'll definitely go pretty deep in that. Um, Matthew Watts says food trucks still beat um, gas station. Sushi is like the most foul. Like, oh, man, I just feel like that's such a risk. Where's he going to go with that rat? I don't know. Like, he's, he's pretty he, boxed he plays in very there. differently than me. Like, he's boxing himself in there. But like your gutter runners, they got a Jody four. So they'll have a. They only fail one out of six, and they get a free reroll for dodge. I would take like number five there, and I just run them straight up. Oh, he's to, going uh, right past the. Oh man, look at that! I don't, yeah, he has I don't to make a couple doing. dodges. Okay. Because he still had time. Like you're only movement four, and his Thor is seven, so he could move back a little bit, kind of force you. Oh, that's risky. Those dodges. So I can I can get a two die on this this guy right now. So hopefully I can I can get him. He might be able to score though. Two die. I feel like two die would be like the name of a gangster. <laughs> two die. <laughs> Yo, is your boy two die and Red Skull coming out? <laughs> Never seen. Oh, sushi. Allagas sushi in the gas station is really common. You've seen that, right, Cabo? 
Uh, usually what I see, I don't think I've seen sushi in a gas station. i definitely seen, like, those nasty sandwiches. It's just, like, half <laughs> oh, cheese. God, those are so gross. Oh, uh, I, I used to know someone who would buy them. Like, yeah, they're pretty good. I'm like, oh. Uh, oh. Oh, is he going for the Beast of Nurgle? I almost threw up in a gas station in Japan once. <laughs> tell, tell us about that story. <laughs> yeah, we went here. So I was a little hungover. I was, I was like, when you go out into the clubs in Japan, the trains stop at midnight. But, like, the clubs close – so we go out. If you miss it, like you, you're just stuck. You had to party until five a.m. Yeah. So it was like the day after that, and like I go out to the gas station because that's where I had to pay my utility bills and stuff. Yeah. And I think I was with my wife, but this is before we started dating. Uh, we met in Japan. Oh. And uh, oh. <laughs> oh. Yeah, got, get tickled. Got him. <laughs> but yeah, so they have like on the uh, on the like the front counter. They have like this like boiling oil and like these different meats and different vegetables in it. And I just, oh my God, I couldn't take the smell. <laughs> there I was in the middle of Japan, like at some gas station that they know me. Because I'm, I'm like the one white dude that comes by every day. Just, just all foul. <laughs> and like every time too, like every two months, I green tea ice cream from them. Because I'm like, oh man, is that, is that mint chocolate chip? No, every time it gets me. Dude. I learned to I learned to read Japanese just so I would stop buying green tea uh, ice cream. <laughs> That's the only reason you learned it. Yeah, so I know how to. I know. I know like tea and dentist. I... Man, this is. I think I can get a two die on him. Yeah, so the goat will be four plus what? one. What? Or a three die. Used to be. Oh, that's, I think I talked to this part. He used to. Be, he was a zero nine eleven. I can't tag oh, looking for army. some reason. Army. Let's see, army. Uh, as Gobbo's your wife of Asian influence, uh, what? No, my wife is blonde hair. She's blonde hair, blue eyes. Uh, her dad was born in Scotland, I think. And he's born in Scotland, but came over to Canada when he was like one. And then his mother's and her mother's family, uh, is also from Scotland. So we're setting up for she the got... juicy three die, bro. It's happening. Oh, dude, it's happening. Where's, where's this beat down going? Well, I'm going to be, uh, Blitzing with Mountain Dew Addict. So I, it, they're pretty hard to take down, so I might need to reroll, but. Um, I feel like Mountain Dew is a little too high class. This guy should be. Mountain Dew? Oh, man. Talladega Knights. <laughs> so I get that three die? Oh, baby. Just an erect three die. Just Goat Ram coming in hard. This guy's going oh, down for sure. Oh, is he going to get it? Yeah. Oh, he's... With a reroll, it's so likely. Okay. From Gotham's <laughs> Reckoning. Oh. This is why I think he should have like held off for just a bit. Split the guy. He split his gutter runners up. He could have delayed one more turn and then gone for the throw. Oh, look at that stupid that rat there. He's just cackling at me. Beast of Nurgle. I think we go for the Beast of Nurgle play. Uh oh yeah, Black. Yeah, too bad about Gojira. I bought a new play. I can't remember what I call it. it something Gojira. Did you replace Gojira? <laughs> the player yeah, that got like eaten Gojira on your team? after after being eaten. <laughs> Gojira after <laughs> after eat. <laughs> yeah. Oh man. I, I figured like Gojira like got pooped out. Like the troll just ate him in like one go. It's like Jonah <laughs> and the whale. Yeah. <laughs> you just had to like There's there's a conspiracy, Gabba, that your wife is Janet. I know, but we know what's really confusing is my mom's <laughs> name is Janet. Oh really? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. My mom's name is Janet. So like But yeah, I was talking to Janet and my and like some people get confused like He's talking about his mom. Mom. <laughs> Hashtag mom? Polly Gojira. <laughs> yeah. All right, he's going for it. Okay. All right. I hope he follows me into the tickle box. Yeah, it's following oh, me. Oh, obviously he's trying. He's trying to get his guy free. I I think he could have just pushed the tickler up. Yeah, yeah, that would have been good too. Oh man, what did he get? Oh, that's a rotter. Ah, that's fine. Oh, Back in got him. Oh, <laughs> okay, I'll just get a loner. I'll take it. Broke his, broke his jaw, bro. It's ruthless. <laughs> the Skaven are coming back with a vengeance. So literally, I'm just going to try and get the ball and then just like pound the Skaven team into oblivion. Yeah. Hey, um, Skaven, Skaven is definitely a, a, a slight. So much of this game is just about positioning. Like, yeah. with the same three players, you can either have good position or bad positions. Oh! oh. <laughs> 67. Oh, okay, that's not that great for him. He's having to make so many rolls here. I don't know, 67, that's a... Okay, just, just run, just run, just just go downfield. You're so yeah. fast. He, he can he get pretty never... far, but I can always catch him with a blitz right at this point. It's it's At least at least if he gets it down on your side of the field, you're not going to get... 
Not gonna Whoa, smash look him. at that route. Okay, he's making all the rolls. Let's see if he makes them all. Uh, why is he got all the... Is... Greed is good. <laughs> oh, foul of disturbing... Oh, now it's next to the tickler. Oh, yes. <laughs> I can't think of the ball because... <laughs> the disturbing <laughs> presence nearby. Oh, my God. Okay, so we're going to get oh, yeah. a little yeah, so, sweet action. For those here. who are asking, my wife is Canadian. Our families are like as opposite as you can be. Sure, family is like the typical Canadian family, and my family is like the typical Southern family. It's glorious, <laughs> dude. Oh, it's great. All right, we're 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 going in. There's not much pounding to be had over here. I think you got it, dude. I kind of yeah. makes me want to play a Skaven team, but they're just a little too reliable for me. The Skaven? Yeah, next league, though, you got to be playing the Kiss Lab. You got to be like Olsar's Dancing Bears or something. I probably will. I'll just get last place and just love every second of it. <laughs> okay, so let's uh, let's go ahead and uh, can leave a rotter on this guy. It'll probably be fine. Can we get there? Oh, shit, I haven't liked your video yet. Let me go ahead and like your stream real smash quick. Smash it. Smash that like button. I, I got to smash it. I got to let you know that I want to see more Blood Bowl. You want more? If I don't hit that like button, you're not How would it. I ever know? How would I know? <laughs> okay, so we're going to go over here and just give the tickler some support. Start to right. get that rage cage going. Let's have a little fun and pound this thrower. He's got a he's got a debilitating thing actually. Oh, he might just go out of bounds actually. We're just gonna. Oh, is this fine? Just keep marking him towards the edge. Like, so the basically guys, how it works in this league is this is a, a twelve week season, and uh, as characters like get injuries, like they carry over. It's not like a friendly game where it all goes away at the end. You're, so your team is affected by every game, so that you have to really like take that into account when you're playing this. Um, okay, so well, I can't really grab the ball without going for it, which sucks. So. We're just going to get in position to grab it next turn, I think. Yes. Oh, sorry. I was answering questions in the, in the You're chat. You're good, man. Do it. Treat yourself. Terry, just don't fall into the lead trap. <laughs> into the what trap? The lead trap. <laughs> oh, with that. Uh, it gives you all your, all the kids love guys that have leap. You just keep on the easy. I know. It's so fun, though. It's so much fun. Oh, it's, dude, I love it. Leap is so good because if you get in situations like how he's in, he's just like, ah, I'm going to. Grab the ball and run for it. So I want to so, go for. Tickle. I was the military. It's. I mean, I don't know. It's definitely a calling. I'm like, I only promote it to people who actually want it. I try to get John Tom to do it, but he wasn't buying it. <laughs> okay, we got that going. That's good. I can say you're better than me. I can't. I can't play nerd. This is just too slow for me. Yeah, it, it is a little stressful at times. It's like not being able to have that like. Two, like two turn like touchdown or one turn touchdown i just can't live that life you can't live that nurgle life i can't live it. i'm not i'm not filthy enough i don't have that dirty sanchez like you <laughs> dude uh, i did you guys enjoy the the mustache pick anna shared i didn't get a chance to see it so i hope it was a good one it's got to be good right yeah, it's got to be how how can it how why would anna ever sh go oh are you kidding me Should oh I feel like that's not worth a reroll. Oh, come on, dude. That guy is covered in slime. You should be surprised. You should be happy <laughs> yeah. he made it as far. Oh, and he's stunned? Are you kidding oh. me? Oh, stanky, stanky leg. leg. Getting the stanky leg. Yeah, I just cut my hair at Great Book of Grudges. I cut it a couple days ago. Yeah, thank you guys for liking the video and everything. It does help with like Google search al algorithms. So um, it, it more it, more people will see the glory of Blood Bowl because of your efforts. <laughs> yeah, Blood, God, Blood Bowl is such a... If you get angry easily in games, this yeah, is don't not play this if you have rage problems. It's it's like so bad; it'll lead to like like drinking and just anger and just no, just don't. <laughs> just just don't. You just you, cry. You will lose sleep at night. Man. You know the one mistake I made there was moving the tickler off the ball because having him there was like a safe bet. Yeah, I, I, he still. But he still has a tackle box on three guys, which is really solid. Yeah, I, all he needs to do is push off. He could probably pick it up with a blitzer and be all right, be a little safe. Yeah. He's gonna probably want to try and dodge with his uh, his his thrower there, but <laughs> Professor Paul says uh, Anna shared the picture of you and his kids at the playground. <laughs> That's not true. <laughs> that doesn't sound. That's that not doesn't true. Sound, that sounds yeah. super creepy. Yeah, it does. Well, I'm glad you guys liked it. One just like what, what is the grudge for, Thorgrim? There's no grudge here. There's no dwarves being uh, being wronged. Oh, oh man. It uh oh. Gets that was a bold. Yeah, why would Thorgrim get angry at Chaos beating up Skaven? Yeah, I mean, if anything, you like this. I'm helping you out, man. These Skaven coming for your goodies. Yeah, someone did leave you. Someone, someone's a Skaven fan. He got one dislike. Yeah. <laughs> someone <laughs> out there is a Skaven player. Yeah, letting, <laughs> letting the hate flow. Oh, yeah, dude. 
Okay, so I got... I got options here. I, um... I could just do this again, yeah. Let's just keep taking him to taking him to task. Probably yeah, if you can just if you can get the ball back, we can see some some of that passing game. The Nurgle passing game. Yeah, dude. Oh, it's so bad. You okay. have to you have to rename one of the dudes like uh, Stanky Arm the Thrower. Just Stanky Arm. Oh man, just level up a goat just for that. Have you ever done the Stanky leg? Like I don't even know what that dance? is. Is it like a dance move? Oh, you, oh yeah. maybe it's a southern thing. Like the Stanky. <laughs> I've heard the song like where they say that, but oh, it's been around for years. Like I've I've known about my. Stanky leg is like a little, it's like a little thing you do. You kind of stay in place. You just kind of shake your leg. It. Yeah, you kind of shake one leg while kind of staying in place. Oh, tickler! <laughs> I see, I see, dead Spartan. He he's happy he got out. <laughs> Turn to Gabo. Honestly, I was so glad when I when you got your discharge paper. So yeah, there's definitely moments like being in the military. You will do the dumbest stuff in your entire life. <laughs> oh man, let's follow. There's also good parts to it, but yeah, there's some moments where like, this is the stupidest thing I've ever done about. <laughs> just dark times. Oh, it's just it's just like, why am I, why are we doing this? Why are we cleaning the floor till 4 a.m.? Yeah, that's right. <laughs> you know, we're going for it. We're going balls deep in the splits right here. Quick, it, quick, it's getting it. Yeah. Worth every penny. Uh oh, is he? Have you moved everybody else? No, you haven't. All right. The only guy I haven't done anything with is my goat, which. I mean, I could take a one. I've reroll, so I might as well. You got kill boss in the backfield, holding it down. Yeah, I'm just keeping him as a deep safety, kind of. Um, so let's get you over here, so we can get a two die on that that gutter runner. Oh, you know, we should probably should ask Valnir if he wanted to join in. Should have. Because I don't know him, so. Yeah. Was yeah. he vetted? I didn't even get a chance FBI to ask. Vet? Yeah. Sorry. I didn't think about it either. I should ask Mr. Nafi if he wanted to play this today. The risky Power strats and Blood it. Bowl. Yes. I think his name is Paladin Nafi. But like him and Alec Glass, like they, they, uh, they're or somewhere, somewhere in the land of floor. We were talking and I, I used to play at some of their stores. Really? Tabletop. Yeah. Back in the day. So, I mean, yeah, if they, if they played like eight years ago, then I might have known them. Dude, it's Alagast been a long is time a, since I gamed in Orlando. Alagast is another hero in our league playing the Ogre Kingdoms. Oh, dude, that was my first game. It's yeah. <laughs> awesome. He's pretty good at them, too. That was a murder of a game. Did you get the Nobblers? Oh, yeah. Like, I had goblins rolling three dice. <laughs> I feel like, like, have you ever seen Ogre Kingdoms do pretty well in, like, large style, like, Blood Bowl tournaments and things? Uh, like, I think they're, after the Halflings, they might be the worst team. Yeah. Halflings are definitely the worst, though, I think. Oh, uh, yeah. It's just, like, it's goblins, they're not the best. They're very difficult to play. But uh, the Halflings just struggle. Because Ogres can RNG you. They can get, like, a ton of Lucky Mighty Blows early. Yeah, like, that I, can't happen. I didn't. I don't know why I didn't ask. Oh, I, I remember why I didn't. Ask. I didn't cast it because like his computer was broken. Mm. Oh man, look at, those, look at those dodges, man! You see it? Oh no, I can't see the numbers. Oh okay, he's looking. He's looking to go for it with his gutter runner. It's like fully surrounded. If he can make it though. He. Oh yeah, he just has to get, then get past my my yeah, If he I mean, can get the other one, if the one next to Spike Bro gets up and moves downfield. Yeah. Like he could run in, do a little shuttle pass, and you'll never catch him. A little shake and bake. <laughs> Probably give him the, the razzle dazzle. Oh uh -oh. no! No! <gasps> Get masked! Nope. Okay. Oh, we're good. Okay, that's fine. Oh, he's fine. No long term injury. Oof. Hey, Gimp Mask is used to being hit. <laughs> he's used to That's why he wears the Gimp Mask. <laughs> oh man. <laughs> it's just like. Uh... <laughs> yeah, it's just, just like, like the guy Pulp from uh, Pulp Fiction, yeah? yeah. Uh, Blood Bowl was released uh, in 2015, Blood Bowl 2. The first one was 2009, I think. Yeah, the tabletop has been around since like, God, the '80s. The Dark Ages. Just yeah, like there was like a slot team. Oh, there's like a Minotaur team. I've only ever seen one copy of the first edition, and it actually was in a uh, game store in Japan. Oh, are you seeing this? He grabbed it. Oh, dude, he can get out of there. See, that's why I would have moved the other guy first, like because he could have gotten up and then try to go for like a shuttle. Because he's oh, he doesn't have a reroll though. He made a lot of rolls right there. Dang. Yeah. Well, I can stuff him here pretty good. With my uh, he, he, I think you're going to stuff him. Oh, yeah. I could probably hit him out of bounds if I just... I think that's the key to the game right now. He's just playing, like, a little too tight. Oh, man. He's getting knocked out of bounds for sure. Yeah. He just... Uh... Oh, no. He, he stopped. 
Uh, dude, I don't know. I you, you have to go for it, man. Like it's too dangerous. Can you reach him with he, anybody? He, he made a couple of fifty percent. Oh. oh, I can reach him with uh, Kielbasa, Yeah. Yeah, I mean, if you can get, uh, I just need yeah, to get he, like old one eye in there. Yeah, kill bossy, just push him off. Yeah, shouldn't be a problem. Yeah, Kislev is the old slon team. They have the same rules. Yeah, see, I can get a, a one die on that. So, well, there are a couple going for it actually. So, yeah, uh, yeah, but I just, I just punch him off here with this, this guy. Get a spike row in there. Let's see if there's anything else I want to take at the moment. Okay, one, two, three, four, five. Ah, I mean, you can. Yeah, it's one going for it. There's a couple guys if you free them up, they can get in there. Yeah, I'm just gonna push this guy off here. That should make things nice and nice and juicy like. Let's follow there. There we go. Oh, he's coming in. Yeah, your Nurgle team's starting to go, starting to shape up pretty good. Yeah, I mean, especially after getting all these points here, it's gonna be it's gonna be pretty solid. So let's just do this. You got any level up so far? No, I think I, I might get one after this game. All right, it's you time. Got a couple guys on the edge. Out of bounds, you go, my my rat friend. We shall stay. Oh. <laughs> it stomped out. The Beastmaster. All right, where's the ball going? Where's it going, George? Nurkran Beastmaster. He got knocked out. He did. He he almost did made ever, a breakaway there. Did you ever watch that movie, The Beastmaster? Oh, yeah, the 80s one? Yeah, that's how I met him. No, you met that guy? Oh, yeah, dude. I met him, like, it was supposed to be like 2005, 2004. Dude, that's awesome. Like, uh, they have a big thing uh, called Dragon Con in... Uh, Atlanta, Georgia. Yeah, and like they have like a signing area, and they they had the guy. He's I can't remember his name. I think he played how? No, he played somebody. He had the guy from Red Dwarf. They had like a couple porn stars. They had Jessica <laughs> Alba when she was in a uh, Dark Angel. Oh man! Like all these small time things, and uh, <sighs> they had the Beastmaster there, and I met him, dude. His grip was monstrous. Just the death grip of the Beast Lord. Oh, yeah, dude, because he was a bodybuilder, right? Wasn't he, like, competitive yeah. bodybuilder? Oh, dude, all those, like, 80s, like... What are some of the other movies from the 80s that are, like, just ridiculous? Uh, well, like, Conan started it, but it's, like, Conan the Destroyer, Kroll. Um, yeah. Beastmaster, all the whole sort of... I love it. Even Willow. <laughs> oh, man, that's going... That's taking me back, dude. Down you go, Queek it. Let's, let's, uh, let's just stay. It's fine. Uh, he should have named. He should have named one of his blitzers. Quick hit, ball ball taker. <laughs> ball ball taker. Yeah. So, be like, no, I'm not. Ooh, injury. Okay. Okay. Oh, this is not good. Yeah, I have a reroll, so hopefully my rotter can just pick this up and we'll be done. He with just it. he just needs to scatter to the winds. Just everybody yeah. runs. Just like it's like when you turn on the light and all the cars just. Okay, we're we're fleeing upfield. We might be able to score. No, what do I have? Yeah, I have two turns. It's possible. I think. Yeah, uh, I yeah, dude, you gotta show that Nurgle superior passing game. I'll probably try a pass at the end if I can't quite make it. The boy will Mountain do it. Mountain Dew Attic. All you gotta do is like get up to him and just give a little, a little tuck. A little. Yeah. Great book. I did see the new Age of Sigmar model for uh, for Marathi, which is, she's like. Oh, a, she's a new model. Yeah, dude. They just re-released her in Age of Sigmar. She's like a giant ser serpent beast thing. Oh, good. Her, I mean, her <laughs> old model is pretty terrible. Yeah. Yeah. So. Yeah, it's cool. Age of Sigmar, like, I've seen people playing it in my local games workshop, and it looks fun. It's just, uh, I don't know, it's hard for me, because I'm so rooted in the Total War fantasy universe, and, like, you know, that the old 8th edition, that, like, I, I just get, like, a little sad when I don't see the characters I'm... The I'm lore to, to me is just a little crazy. And, uh, yeah, it's true. Like, I've gotten attached to Carl Franz and Boris. And <laughs> Valnir Arthur. says, you see Valnir, he says, look at my sideline. Four, five, six, seven. Oh, man, that's brutal. One, two, three, four. Oh my god, that's awful. She became a Medusa that's, with dragon wings? Yeah, that's basically what it is. I'll have to check it out. They had a Medusa for the uh, Cauldron of Blood. Yeah. Used to be like on top of it. Look at those and dodges. The dark, Oof. The dark Eld, uh, Eldar, I can't remember what they're called now. They have a Serpent Warrior as well. Serpent Warrior. Um, yeah, this is basically turn-based Warhammer football. Rugby. It's yeah. really fun. It's like... Total War is very intense, fast-paced in terms of multiplayer, and this is like a great way to just relax and talk to people and, and do all that kind of stuff. So, well, this yeah. used to be our relax game where we just wanted to hang out. Yeah, yeah. I'm glad. I'm glad you guys enjoy it though. Like, I, I wasn't sure how people on the channel would re respond to it, but it seems like you know people are digging it. So, um, dude, I'm telling you, I'm gonna I'm gonna start the blood blow lore, so dude, people can blood learn blood about the series. cheese. People can start learning about the Cheese Bay Packers. <laughs> oh my god, dude. They have one team that Chaos All Stars. They're monsters, dude. The Monstars. 
Uh, no, the Chaos All the Chaos All Stars are like the highest level, highest ranked team. So like, you have power rankings, right? So your team, I think, it was like what eleven hundred right now. Yeah, it's it's ten eighty, so it's pretty close. Yeah, ten eighty. I think Soltek right now is eleven forty. He's the highest in the league. Oh, I think Gojira might be the highest. Doesn't he have like twelve hundred? Maybe. maybe. Yeah. We'll, um, we'll check but like this. Chaos All Stars, who's like the official like lore team for Chaos, they're yeah. three thousand nine hundred and fifty. Oh. They're, they are monsters. Look at this. this oh, great. he's putting. Uh oh. Yeah, he's not going to be able to. Tackle box. I'm just going to have to blitz him. Oh, look. At the, he's thinking about dodging with uh, Queek It. Dude, he, have to, he has to. He's got to get out of there. Yeah. 67 with no rerolls is scary. He does still have an APOC, though. Not that I don't think it'll save him at this point. Uh, well, he hasn't had anything, like, terrible. Yeah, no, like, mortal injuries. I think he has yeah. one guy missing next game, but, like, it's best to save it for when someone dies. Someone dies or, like, your thrower loses agility. Look at him go. Oh, he got Claude. Oh. Down for the count. Okay. I want to see the throw. I want to see you like, uh, who, who's this? You want to see a rotter? Yeah, I want to see this this warrior chaos. What's his name? Old one. I want to see him knock off the uh, the, the vermin, and then I want to see kill boss and make the pass to Mountain Dew Attic by oh. for touchdown. Dude, you, you, steep demands, but I'll see if I can oblige. I threw a goblin for you. <laughs> you did. <laughs> Who got eaten by a troll? Dude, that was that was the play though. <laughs> <laughs> Professor Pwn's oh. halfling team is is. I, I think they, they've only lost one game, right? Uh, yeah, I think yeah he lost to Sotek. Yeah, it was it was a good oh, they, it was close though. Gojira? I think it was Gojira actually. Okay. Yeah. Time to pound town this rat. I'm sure Gojira is in the chat. He'll he'll let us know. He'll, he'll know. All right, here it comes. This is it. This is the passing game. Well, I was gonna do a, a little shovel because if I level Mount Mountain Dew Addict here, okay, so you can go that far. So. Oh, you you got agility three. You can make it happen. If if kill Bossa levels up, you gotta give him pass though. <laughs> to have my passing goat, people are just not gonna expect that from Nurgle at all. Uh, dude, I had Nurgle team for a little while. They're called Turin doesn't love us. <laughs> just the neglected. Uh, no Dark Link. I didn't throw the goblin. Uh, the Paul the troll picked up the goblin, and I failed the the throw roll, and then I rolled a one on the snack roll, and so the the troll ate the goblin. I think. <laughs> are you ready for the glory? Uh yeah. Here you go. <laughs> This is it. This is the moment. Oh, we no, that's boys. so bad. What is it? What's the 67, percentage? 67. Oh, you're fine. You'll make it. I feel like I should bash him more, but... Uh, We're doing it. it. There goes my... Oh, no! <laughs> All right, we're trying you to pass. You won't roll two ones. Oh! <laughs> no. It's the same thing I roll with my troll. I swear to God, if he scores. Oh, he can't. Uh, he can't. It's impossible. Yeah, it's you can still score though, like yeah. If I grab it and then pan it if off. If you have him. a guy grab it and instead of throwing it, you just hand it off. Yeah, you got yeah, it. Yeah, we tried. I tried, guys. My rotter is just incompetent. Oh, he might grab it here though. Uh, he can grab it and run away. If but... he does, I'm just gonna bash and just foul. <laughs> well, I guess technically he could score if his Thor managed to dodge and then get on the ball and pick it up and get over there, then he can score. Oh, oh, oh. Okay. Oh. Can I score here? That's I think it. I can. No, I can. I can. I can do some stuff. Let's let's see some magic here. I just need to get the ball to the goat. So, uh, Darkling, I I have other games where I I think I was playing Professor Pwn. And I was actually throwing goblin players like try to get the ball free. I'm taking this fat juicy three dive of, of gods. Oh uh, yeah, you're playing smart now. Just try to get the extra. Oh game. yeah. Oh yeah. Tickler's oh, level. Oh, Tickler's gonna level. He's up. gonna level. <laughs> You gouge his eye out. You're just licking it. You're just like, <laughs> hey, uh, great book of grudges. You did not tell me about your dream. I'm sure it's a. Oh, uh, it's a dream. Apparently, he did. Is it to settle all the grudges? Satisfy the grudge. Okay, so we're gonna do this here. Knock this guy off the ball so we can grab it. <sighs> we gotta reroll it. I hate, I hate this game. All right, so we're gonna <laughs> we're gonna pound town him. We're gonna follow. You know what we haven't seen this game? We haven't seen any fouls. I know. I, I, I want to foul, but I also want to try and score to level up the GOAT. Because I feel like his well, team's already could, taken enough injuries. You could get... Uh, gosh, I don't know. You could put Power Melon or... I don't know. You well, could, I'm going to grab the ball like with my old one-eye down. I don't know. I'm going to try and score. I can score here, potentially, so... 
This guy has dodge, so we're just gonna. That's yeah, fine. You just push him. Push him into the pits, Anakin. Let's see it. I'm waiting for it. This is this is this is it. This is tense. I already used a reroll though. That really sucks. Yeah, you should, yeah. But Kilbasa, he's he's a champion of the people. There he goes it. my Kilbasa. Watch him as. Oh. <laughs> no, no, the glory's over. That's oh. it. He got tickled. The we got. The, we we got the V. I'll take it. Oh, Mount Dew addict getting the level. Oh, oh, look at the tickler doing like like 360 spins in the celebration dance. Oh, I don't get to see the celebration. That's a turnover. We rolled a three. Game. Not bad. I'll take it. And uh, no, we don't want to buy that guy. So Mountain Dew got my uh, MVP. So at the end of every game, you get someone who gets like free star player points. And so he leveled up. This is kind of the breakdown. You can look at the stats and all that. But yeah, we're going to go straight to the, uh, the, oh, the league standings. So now I am. Uh, let's see. League standings. Oh, the game hasn't been validated yet. I got to. Yeah. Val Come on. So bro. Do I just hit Validate. close? Validate, yes. Okay, so let's see if it's, it's updated now. Keep it local. Do it. Uh, let's yeah, it says it's updated. All right, let's check it out. So yeah, leaderboard. Uh, Licking Ann's in first. I don't know how that works. Oh, I got to go to our league. I got two level ups. Oh, man, that's going to be really strong. So the Amazon with Disney's discarded, they're in first place. Uh, Lord Master Sotex in second. I'm, I'm uh, rocking fifth. I'll take oh, it. We're, we're, we're next. You and I are like neck and neck. So here's my team, the Terminators, and I'm 2 0 oh, 1. Gabo's 2 1, uh, 2 uh, with the draw. So yeah, it's two, kind of confusing two. how that works. So everyone ahead of me is two wins and a draw. I'm two wins and one loss. And then you can see uh, here's Magic Potato, which is Black Iron's cousin. We got Alagas, who you guys have seen in chat right here, is 1 1 and 1. Kemri is, uh, let's see, we got that. Well, he, took, he, took the, he took the human team. Yeah, yeah. So he had to so take he, that over. And really, that one loss, one of the losses from me. And we got the halflings with Professor Pone, the true hero. And th in order to get to playoffs, you just have to be in the top eight. So if Pone can, like, like get a win or two, like, he could easily be in contention, for sure. Um, Orcs, Wood Elves, and Skaven are currently... Uh, oh, they want to see your upgrades. They want to see you roll the dice. Let's do it. All right. So I'll have to watch the screen since I can't actually see you roll it. You have to watch. Okay, so we got the Tickler. Oh, the Tickler. Look at him. So we're going to level him up right now, guys. We're doing it. Roll the dice. What? Uh, oh, what we roll roll? doubles. I can get Agi on him. Oh shoot! Uh, Agi's not that. useful at all. Is uh, it? Maybe. Why would you get Agi on the tickler? Well, let's see. Uh, where is the beast and Nurgle? You can get. Well, you can get uh, a general skill. Did you know? No, I can't. It you have to get. You have to get two sixes for that. You're a I can no, get. Just, no, you should be able to click on. Uh, you can't, you can man. Roll I'm, doubles, right? You can't. You roll I, I, sorry, yeah, I rolled a six and a five, so. Oh, okay. So um, I can get a characteristic, Agi, which is pretty much useless because. Yeah, he's, you're not going to be using that. So I think Guard is probably the best, to be honest. Just having him next to the other characters. Yeah, Guard or Thick Skull, probably Guard. Yeah, we're going to go with Guard for the Beast of Nurgle. So what that does is a player with this skill assists an offensive or defensive block. Even if he isn't another player. So it kind of like augments the players nearby. So if I have like a rotter next to him, it's going to make it harder to take him down. It's uh, it's pretty solid. So um, so yeah, we're going to take guard. We're going to level up the uh, the Beast of Nurgle. And he's going to be scary now. Yeah. So, Grab's not too bad either. Oh, you already picked it. Grab's not too bad. Yeah. Yeah. That could have been decent too. Because you can throw him where you want them to go. All right. We're leveling Who's up really the goat. Mountain Dew. Man, so many choices with him. I feel like block is probably really good. Or I could uh, get extra what did you arms. Roll? Agility point? Uh, you know, actually, I think I'll go. I can't get Agi on him. Yeah, but if you get an agility point, that makes him agility four. So he picks up the ball on like a two plus. No, I can't. I can't get agility, unfortunately. Like, yeah, I just I got general. Rolled... Oh, I'm still behind. I'm still yeah, behind. This is for the Pestigore. Um, block is really mutation. good. I could get like a claw. Just be ridiculous. No, it's claws like... are pretty good. Yeah, the claw with the with the the blitz and goat is pretty scary. I feel. Do I want to do uh, that? I can't remember all the all the skills there. Let's see, big hand, big hand, two heads. I mean, block two is heads, safe. Block is safe, but if you want a runner, two heads is pretty good. If I remember what two heads. The, the other goat's gonna be my runner. Um, no, the other goat's gonna be your runner. Yeah, he's like gonna be a block extra arms guy. Uh, this guy, I could just it? give him extra. It'd be arms. nice to have a guy with tackle, so you could get a hold of like dodgy dudes. Or just claws to just murder them, right? Yeah. <laughs> I mean, but like, the tackle also helps when they try to get away from you. So, 
break tackle on the tickler, so he just like waddles. <laughs> nah. Let's see who you're playing next week. Uh, yeah, who am I playing next week? Oh, you're playing the you're playing the Amazons, bro. Oh no, I have to fight. I have to fight the Amazons. Yeah, you're fighting the Amazons. It's gonna be rough. Well, uh, let's look at let's look at them. I could just go for sure hands. I think there's yeah. Some... They all have dodge. Every Amazon has dodge. So sure hands, you rerolled the dice, right? So two sixty seven percent. Sure hands, pretty good for the guy you want to pick up the ball. My other goat has block though, so I'm like loving him having the ball. But uh, <laughs> everyone I'll, I'll go like extra, the I'll go extra arm, sure hands, tackle. Those are right. You need tackle to fight the goblins. Well, I have time, Alagas, before I fight him. So, and and the tackle is going to be useful to take me on. Yeah, the goat's only strength three though. Yeah, but like, it just prevents them from getting away. Because what's going to happen is you're going to play like against Miley Cyrus and. Hillary Duff, and Britney Spears. I'm just reading his team. He, he's just going to move away from you. And he gets to reroll every dodge. Tackle on so, a Pestigore, though? You got to have. I mean, they're faster than your ward. So they can. you can at least tag them and hold them down. Let's see. It's up to you. You got to play your own game, man. I know, I know. I'm just like I'm trying to get feedback here. Uh, yeah. The Great Book of Grudges. Uh, his dream was he's got the vision that his entire body became greenish decay and maggot size of the thumb coming out of his skin. Oh, uh, dude, you need to sign up for that Nurgle train. He's talking to you. <laughs> yeah, you want to join my team? Uh, <laughs> you need to get the great book of grudges on your team. Use dodge if the player throws a block at them. Dude, it's up to you. I can't. I, I can show you. The, I can show you the door, but you have to walk through it. I know. I'm. I'm. I'm looking at the door here. I, oh, frenzy would be fun to surf things too. Oh yeah, frenzy's not bad. I mean, because if he blitzes, he's drink four blitz, and he keeps that. That could really frenzy. catch people off guard. Yeah, that's that'd be a good one. You could surf people off the. What off do you the get, What do you guys think about the frenzy goat? I like that. Frenzy. What's his name? Oh, well, Mountain Dew addict. Yeah, dude. He's like. I know tackle smart, but frenzy's way more fun. Get him. Get it. Frenzy, so I could, I'm trying to think of the path. So Frenzy into Mighty Blow and Claws, that could be pretty disgusting. Yeah, yeah, I would go Frenzy because you already have Horns, which gives you plus one strength on a Blitz. So if you Blitz somebody, you'll be strength four as you shuttle them off. Yeah, Fren Frenzy, I could, yeah, if he plays the sidelines at all, I could really just get deep in there. It's up to you. You got to make the choice. Everybody's, everybody's Everybody. there. Everybody the must choose. <laughs> the GOAT team. And Mighty Blow is going to be good versus, yeah, adds one Everything. to any injury roll. Okay. Frenzy and Claw. All right, we're doing it. We're we're going we're going with you guys. We're going to get the Frenzy. Did you know? Frenzy Goat. Oh, Nobody's going to expect it. Have only been uh. <laughs> All right, Mountain Dew is going to be frenzying. He's just going to take gulps and just go crazy. <laughs> <laughs> He's just like, guys, I got this. He just shakes it up. He's like, like Mount. He's like, I'm all jacked like... up on Mountain Dew. <laughs> Remember that from Tal Talladega Nights. <laughs> Mount, tell he's going code red. He's just getting in there. All right, we we're getting the frenzy, guys, and then we're gonna get claws, and then from there we can do other things. But I want to have a little bit of an X factor on my team because this guy could potentially get pretty wild in there and surprise people. Yeah, I do think eventually you need to get somebody with tackle because, like, yeah, me and Amazon's. There's a couple teams that we're just gonna dodge away from. Yeah. Yeah, I know. We'll see how it goes. I'm just kind of experimenting. And Git Mask is about to level up again. So with him, I'm going to get uh, Sure Hands next. And he's just going to be my runner. So Oh, yeah. every, that was, you were the last game to play. So we've all played. So we can get... Uh, so as soon as Licking Ann's ready, you can play that game. And yeah. I can play Professor Poe probably tomorrow. We can get that Halfling Goblin game. So guys, you're going to have a lot of games coming up soon. You have the Goblin King. Uh, well, he'll probably be... When are you going to stream your game, do you think? Probably tomorrow. Okay. Uh, so, yeah, I think he's working tonight. So, and guys, you're playing uh, Sotek. That should be a good one. There's going to be a lot of games. Uh, and for the record, I'm going to stream every single game in the 12 week season. This is the third game, so I'm currently two and one. Gabo's probably, you're probably going to stream almost all your games, right? Uh, yeah, I'm going to, like, as long as the other person wants it. Yeah. So, you know, we're going to be, we're going to be doing it all. So, you guys aren't going to be missing much. Sotek's going to be putting some of his up, I think. And, uh, yeah, it's going to be a party. So I think that's pretty much it for now, guys. I'm actually going to go and uh, cast some Warhammer battles. So we have a lot of good ones uh, coming up on the channel. Gobble King and I had some and a couple others. So, um, yeah, stay tuned for that. And you got any any closing words, man? Anything you want to you wanna say? Hey, same thing as you say with every other Blood Bowl game. There's no winners, only survivors.
<laughs> yeah, that, that was definitely true. There's just like 15 dead skaven on the ground. They all survived though. Yeah, they're all they're all survived. So they all survived. But, but yeah, that's pretty much. Uh, wait, so he says, turn. You always take mighty blow before claws because claw only. Okay, cool. That's that's good, Soros. So I'll I'll probably get mighty blow on him. Have him be like my assassin goat. That'll be fun. Yeah. But um, yeah, that's it, guys. Thanks again for joining. Uh, again, let me go ahead and read off the donations and sponsors and all that. So let me go up here. Oh, hold on. I'm just, I can't even. Dov, he paid. We got Dead Spartan. Thank you for the donation. Crazy Pyro with the sponsor. King Azajal. Thank you. Azajal. Red Spotted Drake. Well hung. <laughs> well hung and dung. And Red Spotted Drake again. So thank you guys again for all your support. And uh, I, I swear, yeah. some people make these names just so you have to say it. I know. I'm surprised there haven't been worse ones. I really am. It's I've been trolled on stream once or twice with really offensive names, but it, it's usually pretty funny anyway. So, yeah. But yeah, thanks again, guys, and uh, make sure to come check out Gobbo stream tomorrow. I I might be doing uh, his color commentary peanut gallery. We we tend to like doing that. <laughs> we'll so. have Pone in there, and Pone's pretty oh, funny. Oh, that's gonna be a circus. So, uh, <laughs> yeah, stay tuned. Thanks again, guys, and take care.